Today we had to mail off our Sony a7R 3 which is my main vlogging camera. I'm very upset. The stupid audio input jack has been broken on it, so I couldn't use an external microphone, so I sent it off to Sony to hopefully they fix it quickly in about seven to 10 business days. I hate being apart from the thing that I love, but luckily our boy KevDog has allowed me to use this A7R 2 in the meantime, but I really hate inconveniencing other people for my own personal use. It's very frustrating that this is a thing that I have to do in general, but guys, just like in life when something goes bad maybe you like break up with your girlfriend or something you're like oh my gosh life is over i lost my i lost the thing that i love right something good will always come into your life and it, for, in in your case it, maybe it's like less arguments and having more money in your bank account but for me it's uh, i got a new laptop so i i got a new laptop We got ourselves a brand new sex toy, the Gigabyte Aero 15X laptop. I upgraded and so far I'm absolutely loving this thing. It is a beast. I'm gonna put the specs on the screen for all you nerds out there. And I know a lot of you are typing it up already. You're like, Max, dude, you should've gotten Razor Blade 15, man. Um, well, in comparisons to the 4K models, these are identical in specs, but this actually has some better things over the Razor Blade uh, that I need because the Razor Blade can't even SD's nuts because it doesn't have a memory card reader. And this one not only has one, it is a UHS-2 memory card reader, which means it can handle the read and write speeds of my extremely fast Sony card. And the Razor Blade does not have a numerical keypad. I'm a huge fan of those. Really the only benefits the Razor Blade has would be the touch screen on the 4K, as well as like the all aluminum body and maybe like a little bit better speakers but this thing is actually lighter, it is $400 cheaper, and for me, especially the memory card reader, why do, why do companies keep getting rid of that? I don't understand. It's stupid. Uh, even the new MSI got rid of the SD card readers. Idiots. So yeah, this is a better computer than the Razer Blade 15 for me specifically. Um, I obviously just bought this thing. New technology is always coming out. This one is a little bit smaller. It's a 4K screen, significantly faster computer, significantly longer battery life. At a certain point, you are gonna get diminishing returns with upgrading technology, but I use these I use these for work all the time. I travel a lot. So if I can have the most efficient, fastest piece of hardware possible, then I'm gonna get it. And I'm like a, a nerd with this stuff. And when a new shiny piece of equipment comes out, I'm like, I need it. And for all you MacBook users that are like, dude, you should've gotten a Mac, man. Dude, Mac MacBook Pro, ah. Uh, this computer, even this computer takes a actual steamy dump on your MacBook. So, okay, let's go lift some weights. Deadlift day. Went out last night, had a good time, felt a little rough this morning, but when you put on the stretchy pants, just like endorphins and adrenaline rushes through you when you see the deadlift bar. But uh, I think we should just show the top sets because you know, no one cares about hitting Christian's max a bunch of times for warmups, you know what I'm saying? About to attempt Max's bench PR. 515 pounds! 10 pounds up from last week! Triple, let's see how we do! Woo! so skinny and yet deadlift so much weight consistently. I have no idea. Now a lot of you are probably like, Max, what is that crazy run up you do? Why are you so spastic with the deadlifts? And for me, it's a lot of mental cues. This allows me to get my lats into position to get stay tight and then I go down and I pull up. And obviously, I get a little hyper with it. 
That's, I, I yanked the weight off the floor. It's what I've always done. I've tried to get away from it, but I just keep going back to it because that's how I like to do it, okay? Gosh darn it. But we'll try a little calmer. See if we can still do it. No crazy run up. Just think about sad stuff, you know? Still gonna do this, okay? No music? Oh no. <clears throat> Dose. go that's more like it oh baby cheat day sunday you guys are probably like max you cheat like this all the time now even when i'm dieting when i'm not dieting when i'm maintaining sunday is a day of rest sunday is a day for food i don't track my calories i don't track my macros i usually eat a pizza mm. wow mm. and i'm probably just gonna play like fortnite because obviously i will play it's like two o'clock right now. Late start to the day. Everyone's pretty much just laying around on Sunday in general. So, ah, so good. What's your favorite? Everyone comment your favorite type of pizza. Are you team Domino's? Are you team Papa John's? Uh, what do you like to get on your pizza? This is spicy sausage and green peppers. It's so good. Watch this, watch this. Oh my god, what? Yeah, there you go. Two. Oh, 33. Oh, yes, clip that! Clip that! Hit it with a pistol! Oh, 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 oh. Gosh, Max, the transitions in your videos are so good. Show me another one. Give me another one, Max. I need it, dude. Okay. Oh my gosh, Max, your transitions are so sick, dude. Oh, wait, Remix 2018. Wait, 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 uh, wait. Currently 9.30, Chipotle closes at 10. What's your opinion on, like, am, am I a dick for going in at 9.30 when they close at 10? And just to show you, just to show you, I'm just like 9.40. It's 9.33, okay, so now I am a liar, am I a dick? I don't know, 30, I, 15 minutes, I say you can't go in. 30 minutes, you're fine. What's your opinion on that? Max, you suck, disliking the video, man. All right, can I just get a bowl to go with one scoop of white rice? You know what's crazy is that even to this day, me going to Chipotle every single afternoon or night, people still ask me like, Max, dude, what is your go-to Chipotle order? Let me tell you the best Chipotle combination. You ready? Write it down. White rice, black beans, fajitas, chicken, extra steak, mild, medium, 
maybe some corn, and that's it. That's like all you need. And then sometimes I get that in a burrito, sometimes I get it in a bowl, but at the end of the day, you know, that's what I get every single time, and it's delicious. It's delicious! Mmm! So, I want to thank you guys for watching this video. The intro took me forever to film and edit, so if you smash the thumbs up button. Um, I'm not traveling anymore. I'm not going to Chicago Fit, so I'm going to be kind of home for like three weeks. Then I go to Texas for the summer shirting event. Then we're doing a boys weekend that I'm not going to tell you where we're going yet. Go on weekend after that. But um, since I'm going to be home and I'm doing like the same thing every single day, I'm not really sure what I should film or like what you guys would want. So would you want like maybe some Q&As, some more, some more full days of eating, um, training focused, uh, just maybe like whatever I want, cool like edits and transitions like that. Uh, some videos maybe just go old school vlogs and not do any like transitions, no music or anything like that. Let me know down below because I always appreciate your feedback. We are one big happy family here in this YouTube channel, and without all of you, there'd be none of me! Damn, you're so deep, Max. I know. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. I appreciate you, I love you, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!